Hi guys, this is Manmohit here. Today I'm here with my very first video regarding Filmora 9 and today I will be showing you about how to export the video in the highest quality possible. Now, what we need to do is, as you can see up here, right now I am in my Filmora tab. Now I just need to click on the this particular region up here. Just uh, left clicking on this video once and it will automatically open up the dialog box where I will need to select a video. Let's say for this matter of fact, I will select this video up, up here. Now, once you select up here, it will give you two different options. Once I drag it onto the timeline, I hold this and then I will drop it down on my timeline up here. Then it will give me two different options as you can see up here, either match to media or keeping the project settings. Now, every time I would suggest you to click on match to media so that we do not alter or compromise the quality of the original video now once this video is pasted over the timeline now let's say i don't want to put any effects or anything just for the purpose of this video i would be saving it straight away now in order to do so first of all right click on the video and then click on properties now observe the properties which are given up here especially the video part as in what's the original settings of the video okay audio we will figure it out we will keep it at the maximum quality possible but for video the main thing is the bitrate part up here as you can see it's 23,000 something so just remember the big number which is 23,000 resolution is 1920 multiply 1080 so it's the highest HD quality possible for us at the moment after that now when we want to export this video Definitely one thing is you can change the name as in whatever the name of the video you want to keep it Let's say I want to keep it as full HD video now do not export it before clicking on that click on the settings option Now that's the game changer up here now They will give you three different qualities which is good better and best now That tab doesn't really matter because we want to keep some manual settings from our side Which will eventually change it to best quality anyway Okay, as you can see the resolution, that's the exact same which is to the original video. Frame rate is again similar to the original video. Now bitrate is something that I want you to change. Now what you need to do is scroll down at the bottom and click on custom. Over here type in the exact same bitrate that we had as the original video. Now in the original one it was around 23,000 but just to keep it safe I'll put it 24,000 so almost similar. And as you can see. The moment I change it to good, it automatically goes it back. So with typing 24,000, it will automatically lead the quality to the best quality possible. Okay, then audio, it should be at 48,000. If it's not, then change it. Then the bit rate for the audio, it initially is at 192, but then again, change it to 320. Rest all settings, keep it same. Now when you click on the OK button and after that, when you click on export, you will see that the video will be uh, saved at the highest quality possible and by highest I mean to say that it would be saved as per the original quality of the video and that is exactly what we were aiming for so thanks for watching the video I hope you got something out of it and uh, for more videos like this I'll be posting a lot more feel free to subscribe my channel hit the bell icon so that you don't miss any further updates